everyone welcome back to my channel um so today i actually want to talk with you all about um to make sure that you're still taking time out of your life and out of your days for yourself to meet your own needs and um to take time away to take some quiet time maybe take some time to get out in nature even when it's snowing because we do have a snowstorm today um which is super exciting because we're supposed to get actually quite a bit of snow um so we shall see how much we actually get um but i wanted to remind you guys that it's super super important to take um like at least 20 minutes a day and just you know to meditate to read your favorite favorite book or to do anything that it is that you desire. You get to choose what it is that you like and what you enjoy to do. And it's very, very important to do that. So I wanted to come on and see you all um, and encourage you all to make sure that you do do something for yourself today. Oftentimes we get so, so carried away and busy with our every day-to-day -day lives that we forget to take time out of the day for ourselves. So if you had the time right here and right now to take time, even if it was only 20 minutes for yourself, what would that look like for you? What would that feel like for you? What would you do with that time? Would you imagine the freedom you would feel? Can you imagine the peace you would feel? In those moments, what would you do with that time? Sink deep into your imagination and imagine what your perfect best day ever would look like for you. What would that look like for you? What do you see in your mind? Can you go to your happy place right now? Can you relax your mind enough to get there? What does your happy place look like? What does that look like for you? It's important to ask ourselves these kind of questions and to quiet our mind sometimes and maybe have a hot glass of tea and just enjoy life and remember that life can be amazing, life can be wonderful. And it's important for us to feel those emotions. So can you get to your happy place right now? What does it feel like? What emotions do you feel when you're there? Do you feel peace? Do you feel joy? Do you feel happiness? Do you feel excitement? Do you feel bliss? I want you to remember that the more you feel these emotions, the more you feel happiness and bliss and joy, the more that you go to your happy place, the more that you can feel these emotions, you guys, because we are like magnets. The more we think about things, the more we are being happy and joyful and blissful, the more we get to experience it. Because whatever we are being is what is going to be attracted to us. And so whenever we're being in our happy place, we are more um, amazing. And the more we are able to attract things to us. And think about it. When you're happy and joyful and blissful, you want... Like, life around you just seems more happy and blissful and joyful as well, right? When you're happy and blissful and joyful, like, everything around you is as well. And you treat people better when you're in a loving, joyful, blissful state. You treat them better. You talk to them more. You're more open. You're more playful with life. So be more playful, you guys. Go to your happy place as often as you possibly can. You will be so happy you did. But only you can know what that looks like for you. Because everybody's happy place is a bit different than the other person's happy place. So go to your happy place now. And enjoy every single second of it. Because you are amazing and you matter so, so much. So thank you all so, so much for being here and for watching. Love, light, and blessings to you all always. Peace. See you soon.